There are some things about space that are so mind-blowing that they sound made up, except they're 100% real. Today, we're counting down 15 of them. We'll also be dropping hidden, spectacular facts that you won't want to miss. Stick around. Number 15. Sunsets on Mars are blue. Early pictures, the first set in fact, revealed a magnificent skyline in the prettiest pale blue. But why is this? Well, NASA said that this is because dust in the Martian atmosphere has fine particles that permit blue light to penetrate the atmosphere more efficiently than longer wavelength colors. 14. The Apollo astronauts' footprints on the moon could last up to 100 million years. In 1969, Neil Armstrong became the first person to walk on the moon and therefore left the very first footprint. As he took his first step, he quite famously said, that's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. The thing is, that step is going to last a very long time. This is because moon rocks erode at a rate of 0.04 inches every million years, so it could last for 100 million years. Number 13. There is noise in space, and it's weird. NASA uses a technique called data sonification to take signals and convert them into audio files. This allows everyday people like you and me to hear what's actually happening in space. The sound ranges from screeches, beeps, and strange groans. What these noises are is another question. Some scientists have theories, but currently their guess is as good as ours. 12. The price of astronauts is astronomical. There are a lot of financial facts that we could give you for this one, but here's our favorite. It's about the cost of actually getting things into space based on their weight. Business Insider worked out, based on NASA reports, that a 16-ounce bottle of water could cost anywhere between $9,100 to $43,180 to send up into space today. It's no wonder that they have to recycle and reuse every water source they can. Which brings us to our strange space fact that we promised you in the beginning. Or should we say, the first one? In order to live for just one year in space, you would have to drink 730 liters of recycled sweat and urine. Nice. By the way, if you like creepy facts like that, which you can't unhear, be sure to check out our other video, 25 Creepy Space Facts You Can't Unlearn, right here on this channel, along with other space gems. Or should we say, moon rocks. All right, back to it. Number 11. Space is a junkyard. Space is full of junk that we've left behind in all our missions and explorations, including the ones we made before making it to the moon in the 60s, as Russia, China, and the United States competed in the great space race. Yep, that was a thing. The space junk is mostly used rocket parts, broken technology, and dead satellites. These objects continue to orbit the Earth at a speed of about 17,500 miles per hour. The Space Surveillance Network, also known as SSN, keeps track of how much of the junk and larger scale debris is up there. SSN is currently tracking 23,000 objects which are bigger than a baseball. The USA is responsible for the most, having racked up around 3,990 pieces. Russia, not far behind, has 3,959 pieces, followed by China in last place, but in a good way, with 3,893. Number 10. It would take you nine years to walk to the moon. Provided there was a straight path, this is how long it would take at an average walking speed at a constant rate to walk to the moon from Earth. Number 9. Space can be icy and hot. In some far-off places, in-space temperatures can reach negative 454 degrees Fahrenheit, which is beyond cold. Mercury is a particularly odd one, featuring both hot and cold. It has temperatures which vary between 280 degrees and 800 degrees Fahrenheit. Number 8. Space would kill you in 15 seconds at most, even if you held your breath. Because there's no pressure in space, air expands, and that includes all of the air inside the people up there. This means the air inside your lungs would expand until your lungs tore. But holding your breath won't save you because your body would use up all of the oxygen in your blood in 15 seconds or less. That's not the only gruesome thing to happen without a spacesuit. There are other consequences of unprotected space exposure. These could include loss of bowel movement, bloating, boiling blood, and exploding capillaries. Number seven, there are stars in every direction. We don't see stars in every direction, but they're there. The reason for this is because some stars haven't been around long enough for their light to reach us as they're millions of miles away. 
and some of the stars we do see are already burned out. Heinrich Wilhelm Olbers, who posed this in 1823, said, if the universe is infinite, static, and timeless, then everywhere you look should eventually hit a star. There are probably more than a septillion stars in the universe, so it makes sense. And here's our second additional cool fact, because you deserve it, especially if you hit the like button. Every star that you see in the night sky is bigger and brighter than our sun, making ours a baby in comparison. Number six, the Milky Way galaxy has tens of thousands of black holes. Every galaxy has at least one black hole in it, including ours. It's just that some of these are dormant. However, according to a recent study, there are actually tens of thousands of black holes at the center of the Milky Way. Black holes are impossible to detect on their own because light can't escape from them. But when you put it next to a star, their shadows can be x-rayed. Number five, the sun makes up 99.8% of the solar system's mass. We all saw the planetary alignment pictures in class as kids, which is why this might seem so bizarre. Often these are misrepresented because otherwise they would take up a whole wall. The sun is much bigger than we've been led to believe. The mass of the sun is 1.989 times 10 to the power of 30 kilograms officially making it 99.8% of the entire solar system's mass. Number four, 95% of the universe is invisible. This fact is crazy, and it's been discovered that only 4.9% of the mass energy of the universe is atoms. Atoms are what make up every tangible thing, like you and me, moons, stars, and galaxies. It's sort of depressing because it proves that everything science has been studying for the last 350 years is just a fraction of the universe. We prefer to see that as exciting since there's so much more to explore. How about you? Number three, the universe hasn't always existed. The universe hasn't existed forever. That's something we probably knew in the back of our minds but never really considered. It was actually born in the Big Bang. It's also celebrating its 13.82 billion years birthday. Whichever way you look at it, religion, science, or just another school of thought, the idea that the universe popped into existence out of a nothing is really weird. It means that there was a day which existed without a yesterday. Insanity, but that's what the evidence tells us. Number two, Einstein predicted a major space discovery 99 years in advance. On 14 September 2015, gravitational waves were detected on Earth for the first time. These newly discovered ripples, which were found within the fabric of space-time, were actually predicted to be there by Albert Einstein himself. This was in 1916 when he said it, but not confirmed until 2015, 99 years later. Einstein also correctly theorized that ripples would come from the merger of two black holes, dating back to the Big Bang. On to our top spot, number one. A day on Venus is longer than a year. You heard that right. Venus turns very, very slowly in the opposite direction of Earth. It takes 243 Earth days for a full rotation of Venus. However, it only takes 225 Earth days for Venus to go around the Sun because it's so close. That's a difference of 18 days. Because of this, a year on Venus is shorter than a day there, at least by our 24-hour clock measurements. So that's it. We hope you enjoyed this video. For more, be sure to check out our channel, and for upcoming videos, don't forget to subscribe and turn on that notification bell. It takes less time than suffocating in space, and it's way more fun. See you next time.